Hey guys, I just wanted to show you that Summerboard is now working with 1.1.3 firmware. So I'll show you guys how to do this. Well, it's like really easy, but I'll show you guys how to do it anyways. So I'll make it so I don't have Summerboard anymore, and then I'll walk you through it. Okay guys, to get Summerboard, just go into Installer and when you first get into it you should refresh your sources and then a message should pop up that says installer needs to be updated but I already updated it so I don't need to do it again okay once you've updated it just go to recent packages and you should see summerboard has also been updated so install that then restart your iPod Okay, once the sun restarting, you should see SMB prefs, so summer board, summer board preferences, and then you should see the th different themes here. And as of right now, if you download a theme off the installer, you won't see it in the summer board preferences because the uh, repos haven't been updated to save it in the correct place. <clears throat> so I'll show you what you guys need to do if you guys watch this video tonight still tonight as in January 31st the repos should be updated on February 1st in the afternoon so yeah okay you should see a the theme you downloaded so just press home and set your iPod to the side for now. Okay. Then to get your theme to show up on SMB prefs, you need to SSH into your iPod. Okay, and once you've done that, you need to go to library and then summerboard themes and then get the theme you've downloaded and drag it to your desktop or drag it to wherever you want to be saved on your computer just for now so it'll start downloading it shouldn't take that long okay then once it's done you should hit this button right here that says up folder just keep pressing that until you get to this screen. It should have applications and then at the very top, no, dot SVN at the very top and then applications. So then you need to go into mobile, mobile folder, and then into library, and then find summer board, and then themes, and then you should see all the default summer board themes and then drag the theme you downloaded to your computer into that folder into this whole big folder so just drag it anywhere okay and then you shouldn't get those errors but and then you should see the summer board theme you downloaded and then just go it back into summerboard theme and then you should see the one you just downloaded and then let's see what it looks like okay there we go so once the repos are updated you won't need to SSH into your iPod and do all this crap that I just did 
Instead you'll just have to go to installer and download the themes, so that'll be really easy. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that it works now.